Hi, this is Derek with Innovative Angler. And I've had a few people ask me, Derek, how do you fish with a zoner? So today, I'm gonna to show you actually how to rig up a great trout or kokanee setup that I've used in the past that really works for me. So what you're gonna to wanna to have is you're gonna to wanna to have some smaller beads. These are some smaller plastic beads. You could even go with some glass beads here, or you can just go with some basic corkies if you don't have those. Uh, any of these will work fine. Uh, obviously you need some swivels, and for trout, I like the Dick Knight um, Dodgers, and also Mac Lures. Um, so that's what I use. Um, so to start off with, what we're gonna do, um, we're gonna use one of the small beads, put that right on your main line. So the reason I put that on there um, is really to protect the front end of the zoner. Um, so I'm gonna slide that in there, and then I'm gonna put this right through the front of the zoner. That's the first eye, through the second eye, and then there's actually a third eye back underneath the main hydrofoil. So I'm gonna slide that in there and pull it right out the back. So then this bead is gonna protect anything that's in front. So at this point, what you're gonna have is you're gonna have the small bead in the front, the zoner goes all the way through to the back, and then you're gonna have your main line come out of the back. So once the line's through, I usually take one of my larger um, corkies, beads, you get like, again, you can use the glass beads, plastic beads, it doesn't really matter. Um, it's just good to have something um, to protect. the back side of the zoner. Um, so you really wanna have one bead on the front, one bead on the back. You go right there. Uh, next thing you're gonna do is a barrel swivel right off the back. And I'm gonna tie just a regular improved cinch knot. So go around six times. Come through. So I have the barrel swivel on there. So let's go ahead and pull your main line and you can kind of see how this is supposed to set up. So again, we have the bead on the front, line through the zoner, larger bead on the back, and then you have your swivel. So the reason that we're putting this bead back here is so when you pull the line, the swivel will hit the bead, so on and so forth. So the next thing we're gonna do is we're actually going to do, this is for trout fishing or kokanee fishing. So we're gonna put a dodger on. Um, I really like the Dick Knight UV dodgers. Um, they give off a lot of light and trout and kokanee really seem to like them. So at this point, all you have to do is take the dodger and clip it right to your swivel. So now it's connected. So now I've attached the dodger um, I'm going to go ahead and attach the Mac Lure uh, wedding ring spinner. Um, it's great to have the double hooks because a lot of times they'll miss um, or they have the second one on and the other one will go right into them pretty quickly. Um, I really like the Max Lure, um, the UV smile blade because that seems like that works pretty well too for an attractant. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the Dodger. And really what I wanna do, since I'm gonna go Dodger to waiting ring spinner, um, we want the Dodger to move. And with that movement, um, I usually like to go about, you know, two feet is about right. So about there is good. And so I'm gonna go ahead and put on another um, improved cinch knot. And you can tie a bunch of these up um, beforehand, which is usually um, how a lot of people do it. But, you know, since this video, um, we're gonna just do it this way. So now it's connected. So what you have now is you have your small bead lined through the zoner, 
larger bead. And then you have your Dick Knight UV Dodger with your Mac Lure uh, UV wedding ring spinner with a double hook. So we just rigged up the zoner for trout fishing. And so the first thing that we did, um, we have the little bead up front, ran the line through the zoner. Um, you have your second larger bead. Um, that's really to help protect from the barrel swivel that we have here. So the next thing that we put on was the barrel swivel, um, the Dick Knight UV Dodger. And then behind that is the Mac Lure wedding ring spinner uh, with the UV smile blade which seems to work pretty well for trout or kokanee. And I'll say that I've used this, it works great, and you can make all your friends jealous from all the fish you're catching. Thanks for watching, and subscribe to our channel, where there'll be more videos on Innovative Angler and The Zoner. And check us out at InnovativeAngler.com.